I'm Bruce Campbell, I'm the chairman of the Honourable Coast Care Van Care Network. We're here at the old clay target shooting club site. Uh, all the old uh, sheds and infrastructure from the gun club have been demolished and taken away. And we're in the middle of a multi-year project to improve the biodiversity values of the gun club site, but more importantly to protect the adjacent Marm Reserve. What are we doing here today? We're putting in a buffer um, zone to create a break between the invasive grasses on that side and Marm Reserve vegetation on that side. Marm Reserve is, uh, well, starts about 50 metres that way and runs through to Dry Lakes Road. And in the middle of that reserve is a spring fed permanent pond. And uh, in and around that pond, are some very rare plants, plants that have been swept away in the Warrnambool district through the clearing of land and uh, improving of uh, land for agriculture. So there's some very significant plants, um, but there's also some great little animals that are surviving, birds and mammals that are surviving in that reserve. Good thing to do. Um, to promote uh, biodiversity, so there have been sightings of the um, white-footed donut and we're trying to promote that um, habitat to expand their habitat range. Yep. We came here a couple of weeks ago and laid weed mat. Uh, this strip had already been sprayed to try to kill off uh, the introduced grasses that predominate here at the old gun club site. And today we'll be planting through the weed mat and creating um, what we hope will be a, a lush, thick area of native grasses and rushes, etc. You can easily drive past the old gun club site uh, and Marm Reserve and think there's not much here, but it's actually a hidden gem and there's already a lot of bird life and uh, and other wildlife here and what we're hoping to do over the years uh, with other partners working on this project um, is to protect this gem um, and we hope to make it a, uh, a really interesting and enjoyable place for people to visit and learn about the plants and animals that used to be very common uh, in Warrnambool and District. Yes.